get you over to the satellite, let you know the location here of these two storms this morning. Laura is approaching Puerto Rico while Marco is moving up towards Cozumel and Cancun in the Yucatan. Let's start with Laura because this is the one that we're going to be paying attention to here over the next couple of days. Right now, the five o'clock advisory has winds still at 40. Most of the convection and wet weather is back towards the east over the Leeward Islands in the U.S. and British Virgin Islands. Pressure still above 1,000 millibars and that movement still fast at 21 miles per hour. The Puerto Rico radar this morning shows those rain bands moving through. Right now, San Juan getting a little bit of a break, but some heavy rain from Barbuda up towards, again, the U.S. and British Virgin Islands, St. Kitts and Nevis, also picking up some wet weather here early. The forecast track, I know it's what you all want to see here early. We're going to stop this at Monday afternoon. The interaction with the greater Antilles, such as Haiti, Dominican Republic, and Cuba, will weaken this storm and keep it from intensifying rapidly until it gets in the Gulf of Mexico. And when it has a chance here to move as a Category 1 hurricane towards Louisiana, we will still pick up wet weather and the possibility of some severe weather here in southwest Florida. So let's get you to Marco. This storm moving up towards the Yucatan and the Yucatan Channel. The forecast track with this one, 45 miles per hour now. It also has a window here to strengthen to a strong tropical storm before making landfall somewhere in Texas. We have two tropical storms very close together this morning, and we are busy tracking the radar for as well. Lauren, give us the latest on today's forecast.